This is Tampa Bay's 10 News at 6. Racing, speed, and alcohol. We're learning more tonight about the August crash involving Nick Vallea, Hulk Hogan's son. Good evening, I'm Heather Van Ness. And I'm Reginald Roundtree. Thank you so much for joining us tonight. Late this afternoon, authorities released a massive report detailing parts of their investigation and painting a picture of a teen driving way too fast. Tampa Bay State News reporter Janie Porter has that report. She joins us live outside of the Clearwater Police Department with the details. Janie. And Reg, much of that damning testimony coming from one of Nick Balea's friends, Barrett Lawrence spoke with investigators and when asked if Nick Balea and the driver of a silver Dodge Viper were driving recklessly, Lawrence replied, this is how they always drive. Now it was August 26th when the yellow Toyota Supra Nick was driving crashed into a palm tree in Clearwater, leaving his passenger and friend, 22 year old John Graziano, critically injured. Investigators and witnesses say Nick and that silver Dodge Viper driven by a friend had been racing in the seconds before the crash. Balea's friend Lawrence telling investigators Balea was driving about 100 miles per hour. Today, authorities also released the 911 calls. Is there any smoke or flames coming from the vehicle? 